Hello guys, uh, today I will show you how to enable uh, some counters uh, uh, from U2020. So firstly we have to go to performance, then we need to go to measurement, uh, measurement management. Okay, here it goes. So we have to see uh, like which technology counter you want to enable. Like here's 2G, here's 3G. Uh, it can be BTS like uh, for 4G or like in the DBS or NodeBase. So suppose we want to enable uh, one counter or two counter. Uh, just for example of 2G. So. Uh, first we check which counter if you know in which ammo uh, the counter you want to activate is so it will be very easy if you can know it before suppose for example if I select one any one like from KPI measurement okay we click then we go to settings here uh, we need to also check uh, the network entities so you will see here is a list of counters that is available in u2020 and this clicks means that these counters are already enabled so if they are already available you can get the values from these counters so the ones uh, which we don't have the tick mark on are actually deactivated so let's see if we can find any deactivated counters from this MO or not. Let's see. Uh, no, I don't think so. Let's see in the measurement one. We should find some things here. Like if you see one of these things, this means actually the counter is enabled partially means maybe in some bases or some uh, sites the counters are enabled but not in all sites so what we can do if the counter is also disabled we can do it uh, from there also we can uh, like uncheck and check again and we need to like select uh, in where we want to enable these counters like in the whole network or in particular BSCs or in particular sites or something like that so we can select from uh, the left side of this uh, like user entity uh, I mean network entity so if you if we click network you will see uh, here it comes the measurement cell performance uh, all means in all sites the counter will be activated so we have checked the counter and we have checked the all the entities now we just apply so if you click ok then if you go to records it will update ok succeed so now you can check after after a few minutes and uh, the counters will be updated and you will get the values so that's it thank you very much